Graham, it was a defeat. How do you sum up what happened in the match? Um, first half, uh, the only difference between the teams was a one strike from their boy. Um, you know, we had some brilliant chances before that. Should have scored, uh, we didn't, and um, they take that opportunity, which is. Uh, Frustrating for us because uh, I didn't uh, feel in, under any serious pressure in our goal. But um, second half, we spoke at half time about making sure that we were in the game right to the end, um, you know, and, and not uh, go gung ho to, to get the equaliser. You know, the second half can be a, a long time when you want the in in front. Um, so we didn't want to give a, a, a second goal away and start the second half. And I think it's within the first 15 minutes we do, and it's a poor goal. And um, you know, it was difficult for us after that. I didn't think we covered ourselves in glory after that second goal. As you're saying, there's a lot of chances in the first half. Was it the difference between them being clinical and us not so? Yep, yeah, and it's not the first time in, in this little period for us. You know, we, we've had opportunities to score uh, and to put ourselves in front, which we haven't took. And it's hurt us badly um, because um, certainly at the minute away from home, we can't keep a clean sheet. Um, we, we can't... Uh, we're not ruthless enough um, with the ball, um, against the ball and with each other at both ends of the pitch. Um, so I know uh, I've been in the game a long time and, and it doesn't matter what you're doing in those, the middle part of the pitch if, you, if you're not uh, clinical enough at both ends and at the minute that, that's not uh, where we are and I thought and then the, the game towards the end um, petered out because I thought our heads went down and we didn't show the response that I expect from the players that they've shown many times before um, and that that's, um, hurts me more than anything because um, I think it leads to sour taste in the mouth. I always um, support players and want to be one players where if they give all and, and they commit to everything I, I felt we felt uh, I, I felt we looked like we felt sorry for ourselves um, with 20, 25 minutes to go and um, professional football will crush you if, you if you go around feeling sorry for yourself so um, we have to get that out of our system as soon as possible. How do you get that out of the system? Being in mind it has been a challenging run, what is, what's next then? Well we have to look inside ourselves and ask ourselves if we really want to have a good season or we're just hoping for it or we just want to do what everyone else outside of Motherwell expects us to be and that's just a, um, in a bang average position in the league and no one's bothered about us. Is whether we want to um, uh, define our destiny or we, we just uh, go with the norm or what people expect of the norm. Um, so that's the challenge for us. Um, I know where uh, the majority of us want to be, and, um, but it's no good talking about it. We have to act upon it and that's, that's it. It's, it's not about words, it's about um, putting into action and actually showing how much you want to be a winner. Thank you. Okay.